In 1936, Steinbeck was approached by a San Francisco newspaper to write a series of articles about migrant farm workers in California. These were the Depression years. In Oklahoma, Arkansas, Texas, Nebraska, and Kansas, enormous numbers of people were being dispossessed of their small farms through a combination of bad farming practices and harsh winds that blew away the topsoil, creating a so-called dust bowl in these regions. Tens of thousands of families made the long trek to California in search of agricultural work and a better life. But their hopes met a harsh reality. As Steinbeck drove down through the Central Valley, stopping at migrant camps along the way, he wrote, thousands of them are crossing the borders in ancient rattling automobiles, destitute and hungry and homeless, ready to accept any pay so that they may eat and feed their children. Steinbeck was startled and outraged by what he saw. Whole families living in cardboard boxes. Babies were dying from lack of food and medicine. Out of this experience, Steinbeck created his great novel, The Grapes of Wrath, which awakened the entire nation's heart and conscience to the plight of these people. In 1962, John Steinbeck was awarded the Nobel Prize for Literature. 